Allah. Allah, 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 Allah. 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 What's the ayat? Everything wet or dry? Nothing wet or dry, but it's recorded in a Kitabi Mubin, a clear book. Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala. Remember the ayat? Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Wa yadrubim wa la yadisin We said before the story of Shaykh Mohideen, we'll say it again in order to mention his name and ask his holy Imdad, Shaykh Mohideen ibn al-Arabi, Allah bless him. Mother Shaykh said, whatever, Allah bless Mother Shaykh Nazim, Mother Shaykh Hashem, make them to look to us spiritually. Shaykh Mohideen, Allah bless him, he was coming with his murids riding on the back of a donkey in Damascus. Damascus, where his Makam is, is a mountain, hilly, very steep. It's very steep going up and steep coming down and narrow. The old, old cities, like Fez, like uh, the old cities of Morocco and the Middle East, you can put a car very narrow, only donkeys can go, and foot pedestrians, foot traffic. He was coming on the back of the donkey, and his marids were alongside the donkey, accompanying their sheikh. When the donkey, he stepped on a rock, the roads aren't paved, there's stones and rocks everywhere. He stepped on a rock and slipped, and Sheikh Mohideen fell off onto the ground. It wasn't a long fall, donkey isn't very tall. <laughs> How tall is a donkey in Morocco? <laughs> and the Marids, oh, our Sheikh, our Sheikh, they're rushing to pick him up and help him. He said, wait, wait, leave me here a minute. And he, our well, Sheikh used to go like this. He was consulting his heart. May Allah grant us to be able to consult our hearts. We can't consult anything. He was consulting his heart and he said to his marid, leave me. Said, oh, our master, what's, what's the matter? He read that ayat that Imam Bilal just read. There is nothing wet or dry, no leaf can fall, no any except it's recorded in a kitab in Mubi, a clear record. A clear book. And he said, I'm looking to find where this donkey stepped on that rock in this place, and I fell on this spot. And he was looking and he found through the uh, unveiling of the meanings of Holy Quran, Grand Sheikh Abu Dagestani al he said every ayat, every letter, every huruf, every harf has 12,000, at least 12,000 meanings as a beginning. And each time you read it, 12,000 new meanings. He was finding among all those meanings, he was seeing where that donkey stepped on that rock in that place and he fell on that spot. Ha, ah, no, I found it. Anybody can read that. We, can, we read that ayat. We're not seeing. Everything is there. Allah said, I put everything in the book. We're reading Quran, but we're not reading Quran. We're not seeing it. So many puzzling happen today. I'm saying, what's going on? What's going on? What's going on? If I'm able to look in the book, it's coming now, Sheikh Ramadan, Sheikh Quran. We have to see what happened. We have to see it. May Allah grant us to follow our grand Sheikh. 
they were taking the lights of Holy Quran, making Khatimu Quran. What's Khatimu Quran? Real Khatimu Quran. When somebody finishes Quran, we read Fatiha for them. We have a party. And Sheikh Hashem said, Real Khatimu Quran. You finish the Quran with the 12,000 meanings on every letter. Even you read the letter, Aleph, Ba, Ta, repeats in different words, 12,000 new meanings come. Aulia were trying all their lives to make a Khatimu Quran like that. He said, Shaunak Shaban, first by his Bastami, Kodasalam, and then Shaunak Shaban and uh, other Shiuk were trying once in their life. And then, I'm sorry to say, but I have to take it. Hi, Penny. Hi. Uh, full incident written, written and described in Holy Quran. We were saying that Aulia were trying all their life to be able to take the real meanings of the Quran to make what they call Khatimu Quran for the Aulia. Sheikh Hisham was speaking about it. To complete the whole Quran with 12,000 meanings on every harf, every letter. And he said, Bayezid Bastami finished one time. Shaunak Shaban, like that, two times. By the time I came to Sheikh Sharafuddin, he was able to do several times until it came to our Grand Sheikh. Grand Sheikh Abdullah Dagestani, Allah bless him, Sultan Aulia. May he look to us as a charity. As a charity. Sheikh Hashem said, take your help from Sheikh Mohideen and Sheikh Abu Qadr Jelani for all your affairs. Don't bother the other, other Aulia. But we're begging to our Grand Sheikh, look to us as a sadaqa for weak people. We're like the ones begging in the street. Give us, give us something. He was able during his life to complete Holy Quran with 12,000 meanings on every letter, in every inhale and every exhale. It's beyond our imagination. No one can imagine it. We tell the story, but what, who can, what is that? They were taking the meanings. They were living in another world. Prophet him. he said, I have one face with my Lord, one face with people. And they were experiencing what we can't imagine. We, Quran says, you imagine the mountains to be firm. Look at the mountains, you imagine that they're firm. But one word from him and they'd be ground into power, because leveled out, moved like the clouds. It means we, this earth, this world for us is solid and unchanging, but it's not solid and unchanging. Everything is in motion, moving. And we haven't got the vision to see the reality of what's going on. Only a blink. Well, Sheikh Hashem said, like an imagination. Something comes, something goes. Warida. Coming and going. Something flashes. Allah is showing us what he wants to show us. SubhanAllah. Look this Zoom technology. I'm sitting in Chicago. We're sitting in Houston. Others may be sitting in other places, yet we're all together in one place. How? Our bodies are not in the same place together. 
It means we are not our bodies. Something else that we say is we, we're connected in another way that we can be together like this. You're listening, I'm speaking, and we're together, although we're physically separate. If I turn off this machine, we're alone in our places. Subhanallah, Aulia are not in need for these machines. How many times have you said it? But we're weak ones. We're weak. We didn't reach yet. But we intend to follow our Grand Sheikh. Rana Sheikh Hashem said, Grand Sheikh reached what we spoke about to make that exalted Khatimu Quran with 12,000 meanings on every inhaling and every exhaling. Then he said, what passed to Malala Sheikh Nazim, no one can understand. He took it on from there. We can't understand that. What about he took it on from there? What were they doing? How is their existence? And then what about prophets of Allah? Keep quiet. What about Allah? Keep quiet. What you know about Allah, subhanahu wa ta'ala? All of it belongs to him. Who can know anything about it? Samawati are in his hand to roll it all up. Not only Samawati are whole creation. No one can imagine how many Worlds are going on at every time. There is how to describe it. They say multiple outcomes. You can hear me okay? I can't tell from the picture here. You there? Anyone hearing? I can't hear you. I can't tell. Tiny picture, my eyes can't see you. I'm sitting alone in a room. They say multiple outcomes. We're going along a road, and there's a fork in the road. You can go this way, you can go that way. Come, instead, both outcomes is going on. You went this way, there's another world where you went that way. You reach to this conclusion, you reach to that conclusion. Others are all going on their way. Home. Multiple. Worlds are going on the same time. No one knows. How many? How many? We don't know anything. Alhamdulillah. We're coming now to Holy Quran, Holy Ramadan. Shafu Quran. Shafu Nur. Shafu uh, Ishtama. Shafu Suhur Iftar. The holy month. The month for diving into the oceans of holy Quran. Someone went to Sheikh Nazim once. I watched, I saw it. and said, Sadie, should we read Holy Quran to finish a certain part each day? Should we read Holy Quran to memorize it? Should we read Holy Quran to take deep meanings from it? He said, yes. <laughs> All of it. And we say from now, that we're intending in Holy Ramadan to begin to dive into the ocean of Holy Quran 
May Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala make us to swim in its ocean and to take lights from that. We don't know what kind of lights. We don't know what kind of ocean. But we're intending. We're asking this Ramadan to be a blessed and fruitful Ramadan. Prophet said, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, Rajab, Shafrullah, month of Allah, Shahran, uh, Shaban, Shafri, my month, Prophet's month, Sallallahu Alaihi Wasallam, and Holy Ramadan, the month for the Ummah, to reach the fruits, planting and plowing and harvesting, and, and planting and watering and tending and weeding in Rajab and Shaban, and to harvest the fruits during Holy Ramadan to eat. May He grant us from those. Not to go empty. Not to go empty. Oh, our Lord. We come to your uh, banquet table. Your Eid feast as beggars. Empty. Grant us. Grant us from oh, the lights of Holy Quran that we never imagined it. Grant us to swim in that Rahma, in that mercy oceans, in that knowledge oceans, in that lightened oceans to take, to make our souls happy to come at the end cleaned and raised up inshallah to new understandings Allah Messiah Sayyidina Muhammad from one side you look at the current situation everything is terrible everything is messed up on the other side nothing happened except he won the trial he created he decreed all this we have to be happy from that. Must be wisdoms in that. Well, Sheikh Nazi said, you think this virus say, is anything except an obedient servant? It was sent by its creator to do what it was ordered to do. What is our... We have to look in there for the wisdom. Aslam, Aslam now. We surrender ourselves to you, O our Lord. Alimna, teach us, grant us knowledge. Sab, pour in our hearts knowledge and wisdom as you poured in the heart of, as prophets always say, poured in the heart of Sayyidina Abu Bakr. I put it in, I transferred it, I transmitted it to his heart. What school Grand Sheikh went to to become Grand Sheikh? What, what university Sheikh Nazi went to to become Sheikh Nazi? What uh, college Sheikh Hashem went to to become Kutum Poured into the heart. We're asking like that. Grant us. We're weak and we're coming weak. The dua for beginning these holy months saying, I'm coming to your door weak. If there is a door for good ones to enter and a door for bad ones to enter, I have to come through the bad door. No other door open to me. Coming with nothing. Coming with nothing. He used to say, come with your cup empty, we can put. Full cup? Who? Oh, they can't put. It's going to be wasted. May Allah grant us from his mercy and his light and Look after all our affairs. Yeah. Imam Bilal, remember the ayat from Surah Kaf? Uh, if you leave, worship everything else what they're worshiping and run to the cave, Allah will look after all your affairs. You know that one? <laughs> Allah will solve all our problems. We can't solve. We think we're so smart to solve, we can't do anything. Sheikh Nazim always used to say, we're asking for Mahdi. To come and clean this world and to be with him. When do you think he's coming? We asked. He's coming when every heart follows that ayat and leaves what they're worshiping beside Allah, 
leaves to worship themselves in their own power and intelligence and figuring it out, runs to the cave of Allah, runs to the cave of prophets of Allah and awliya, and leaves their matters to him, he will arrange everything. When whole mankind is saying, save us, we can't do anything. Not, we have a 10-year plan, we have a five-year plan, we have a global reset, we have a military plan, we have an intelligence plan, we have a, a national health plan. No, when they say, oh, our Lord, oh, our Lord, we come to you with nothing. Save your weak servants, Allah will send that time. As long as people are believing only in themselves, no need to send. Why? Matthew, come, I came. Hey, no need. I'm busy solving. I'm taking care of it. We're like that. We're like that. May Allah forgive us. That's our ego. Every ego secret uh, target to be God, to be Ilah. Like Fir Aum, Rabbi Kumar The secret target of every ego. May Allah save us from that bad ego and make us to be his sincere servants. لا حول ولا قوة إلا بالله العلي العظيم. Make us to enter safely to Holy Ramadan. I heard they're starting Tarawih on Monday night, inshallah. We'll see what we're going to do if we do it on Zoom. Uh, we might go to the Asr Sheikh and do the Tarawih from there and put it on Zoom also. We'll discuss. We'll discuss it afterwards. What? You're going to make tarawih in the mosque on Monday night or at homes? No, I we were, we were intending to do it at home, but. Uh, okay. okay. Like we, we can do it like that. 